Hey everybody, welcome back. Thanks for watching today. And as always, please subscribe, like, hit that notification bell. I appreciate your support. So today I'm out for one of my last rides for the season before it gets really cold up here in central Pennsylvania. And just kind of out on a nice day, mid 60s, enjoying the fall colors. And to be honest, getting lost in York County, riding on some roads I haven't been on uh, pretty much ever. And just seeing where they go and where I end up. So last year was my first winter riding and I did not winterize my bike per se. I actually rode it probably once or twice a month throughout the whole winter. Our winters here where we are tend to fluctuate a lot in temperatures. We'll have temperatures ranging anywhere from 10 degrees to 50 degrees Fahrenheit. And on days that it warms up a little bit up to about 50, I'll usually go for a short ride just to keep the bike going. So I'm kind of curious, I know this is a bit of a short video, but I'm kind of curious for the rest of you, what you do for the winter with your bikes. Do you do a full winterization? I've seen videos where people talk about not just stabilizing the gas tank, but uh, getting the wheels off of the, um, off of the cold garage floors or and things like that. Putting the battery on a tender for the whole winter. So I didn't do any of that last winter on my previous bike, which was my first one, the Vulcan 800. I just left it sit in the garage as is. I never had a problem starting it. Of course, I don't know how old the battery was on that bike. I know the battery on my Scout is quite new since I had to replace it when I bought the bike. But I'm curious what the rest of you do. Do you, um, do you fill up the gas tank all the way and make sure it's completely full? Do you put some sort of stabilizer in the tank? Do you take the wheels off the ground? Do you put it on a battery tender and just leave it sit for the winter? Do you ride regularly to keep give the bike some chances to warm up? Leave a comment below. Let me know what you guys do. I'm really curious about this. And wow, speaking of situational awareness, I did not see that coming until that deer came out in front of me. That's the second deer I've seen in the past couple of weeks. I guess riding around the back roads in York this time of year is and can be adventurous. Anyway, it's a short video, but that's all I have for this time. Take care, you guys. I think I've got one more ride coming up this weekend. And then it's going to go down to the mid 40s and I'll be done for a while. I still have some footage so I can do some videos if anybody has any suggested content they'd like to see or hear about in the in the next uh, few weeks when things are cold. Uh, leave a comment, let me know. Talk to you guys later. Thanks for watching.